Oh, hey. I didn't forget about small land or anything. I feel like I'd put some time into a little side project with this game before I continue on the other projects that I want to do. I, I want to finish my zoo. So I'm going to spend the afternoon working on the zoo a little bit. I just had to get my Sheer and the Wanderer fix in there. And now I need the game to, uh, there we go, recognize my controller. I notice it still says early access on the, uh, on that top title screen. But yeah, we're gonna continue our profile. It's too bad I can't change the name of the world. <laughs> I don't think I can change the name of the world. I'd have to delete it. So we're just forever hardcore four. And oh boy, it's been a few days. It's been more than a few days. It's been a few weeks. So I need a uh, I need a good reminder here of what we were doing. Hey. Hey, yeah, these stamina tonics. I never ended up using the stamina tonics because I don't think you really need them. <clears throat> I'm gonna put them away in here. <laughs> Damselfly, Hornets, Grasshopper, Gecko, Spiders, Treats. Alright. So we are currently at the point of the game where I am just taming pets. And what's here? Should I have my scorpion here? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> the game's gonna have to like load in again, I guess. It's been a it's been a while since my computer ran it, so there's gonna be those lag spikes as it's still figuring stuff out. Hello Vath, you cute little bastard. It's been a while since I've done hold up. I didn't mean to do that, but I was trying to remember. So I know this is crash, and we can slide now because you know we're not doing the permadeath stuff no more. So I can fuck around and fly, harvest stuff or fly. Oh yeah, I think we need to do a metal run if I'm not mistaken. And then bring some more metal supplies over to the other thing because we were going to make it out of metal even though metal's obnoxious as hell to work with. We need more clay mortar too. So I'm going to do a metal run. And if I'm doing a metal run, it'll be easier for me to have my scorpion in my party. Do I have food and stuff? <clears throat> yeah, we got plenty of food. And then what's, what's the shortcut for the map? In this. Oh, it's down on the D-pad, yeah. Just want to have a nice look around again. I think we basically finished all that there is to do in the game for the most part. There's, uh, I can buy decorations off of the merchant to fancy up the house. <clears throat> and then we want to finish discovering stuff and things. And finish exploring, right? Because the idea is to collect one of every pet variety, including all their unique varieties. I know we found some cool geckos last time we played. But yeah, we're gonna do some light farming to begin with. <clears throat> Sorry, it'll take me a while to get going because it's been it's been a while. I'm trying to remember. What exactly I'm doing. I should probably go tame the damselfly just to get the damselfly tree out of my thing. So I think that's the next tame I'm gonna do. Because I'm only aware of the one.
We'll tame it before we head back to the zoo. Yes, yeah, so we'll have my uh, music playing for the variants. Oh yeah, right. <laughs> we uh, we be launching now because I'm fearless to death. Ah, oh, so good to be fearless to death. So I would have liked to have done this during the hardcore portion, but don't want to risk dying. Okay. Oh, the game's got so much loading to do. It's okay. Once it gets warmed up, <laughs> I feel like the game has to do a lot of that preset rendering trickery so that it starts loading faster as time goes on. <clears throat> Hello, Hornet. I'll be taming you soon. Hey, let's call over the god himself. Vath, the warrior, scorpion, monstrosity. I'm sure Vath will be fine with whatever he fights in this area. Come here, Vath. Let's, uh... Let's get rid of this guy and we'll start right here on their scrap runs. Yeah, we'll be doing a lot of scrap runs for uh, what we need. <laughs> oh good, I leveled up. Do have stats to spend? Not really. I'm just gonna keep leveling the same things that got us through, for the most part, the hardcore section. <clears throat> For anyone who's curious, I don't have plans to try and do a full completed run in the hardcore because I do I do think I could do it. I think it would be inevitable for me to do it. We I would need to rewatch my footage to keep it fresh in my mind, but climbing up the tower, we know I can do it without getting shot by the murder archers. Uh, that is definitely doable. Worst case scenario, I just hardcore spend the literal week <laughs> grinding ammo and then we can long range shoot everybody up the tower. That's not fun though. You can just climb the tower very, not very safely, but relatively safely. We did it multiple times at the end. Making it up to the boss was pretty easy. And then we know we can cheese the boss with the gun by flying onto that tower, so we wouldn't have to worry about dying to it. Unless they patch that out. And we want bug limps for clay mortar. And good old running up to me, accidentally riding my guy, and we'll accidentally smash him too. I don't doubt. Yeah, I was in the mood to work on the farm today. Now it's uh it's an afternoon for me, so I'm just gonna spend a few hours on the task. Feel free to join in and uh, scrub around the video if you want. You know, it's going to be a lot of farming. It's a lot of farming and it's a construction project, so maybe not as entertaining as just going to the game and surviving. <clears throat> as we have the survival part down pat. But, entertaining for me. This is a project I want to finish, see through. 
And then, uh, I suppose while we're doing this, I can just talk about, I don't know, random plans for, uh, the future of stuff and things on Air Channel. Which is generally going to be lots and lots of SNES. Oh yeah. So I was watching, uh, Spike Vegeta, because he's working on his own SNES challenge. Pretty sure I've mentioned this numerous times at this point. And if you don't know him, check him out. I don't know how you don't know him. He's the face piece of speedrunning AGDQ, SGDQ. One of the face pieces, I feel like. Very popular guy. But he did Axley recently, and it kind of made me want to replay Axley. Now, I have my secondary playlist which we've only done one thing for my SNES challenges where I will do challenge playthroughs of various SNES games I don't think I need this other stuff as much but uh one of the things that I would like to do when I'm done with the super side quest is keep playing SNES, because I love SNES stuff, but we can do challenge runs of the games instead of just casual playthroughs of whatever. And I'm hoping, not hoping, but for shooters, I think one of the most obvious things to do is hard mode, one credit clears, but instead of just one credit clear, I'm kind of interested in possibly doing hard mode deathless attempts. And since I'm kind of in the mood to do Axelite, I might do some attempts for that now. Or not now, but sooner rather than later. So, no guarantees I'll get around to it, but... That should be on the horizon. For those of you who enjoy my Toho Arcadia playthrough, I will get back to finishing Toho Arcadia. We are nearly there, but there's still quite a few dungeons to go. We're on like the last half of the game, and there is post-game in it. There is post-game dungeons, and I want to tackle that stuff too. So, I will get back to that. Fret not. <clears throat> now, I don't know when I'm going to return to my SMT5 hard mode. So, for SMT5, the thing is, they're releasing very soon. What is it, like, this week? Or next week or something? Or sometime soon. They're getting, um, the remastered version of SMT5, aka apparently a completed version of SMT5, because the current one has some incomplete stuff. From what I understand, from what I've seen other people talk about. So we're getting SMT5 Retribution or some bullshit. Now, I'm not made of money. I'm, you know talk about that all the time. I'm pretty open about it. I am poor. I am broke. So I don't have plans on buying the updated version of SMT5, but because there's an updated version, I might wait on returning to my hard mode playthrough uh, on that. And down, down the road. Some, some day, at some point in time, hopefully, I'll get back to it eventually. But I don't have plans to get back to it anytime soon, unfortunately. So that, that one's going to be floating in the, the long-term ether, as many of the other games I've played are stuck in the long-term ether. <laughs> now... On the, the note of long-term ether games, I have been feeling up to some tabletopage. Stuff again? Oh shit. <laughs> I forgot we're on hard mode. I really should get on my scorpion to kill all the flies.
but I have been feeling up to tabletop. So I have uh, one, we have the ongoing Kingdom Death monster, the persistent campaign thing that I started. It doesn't have any definitive ending. But with a lot of new KDM stuff out, uh, I might resume that. I might start season four up. And uh, maybe. <laughs> we'll see. Because I know it's quite a bit of dedication to sneak that in. <clears throat> Holy jeez, man. I forgot how deadly flies are on this difficulty. Probably the most deadly enemy in the game. It's fly groups. But yeah, we've got the uh, KDMs. I'm interested in learning some other board games. Uh, not on tabletop, unfortunately. I'm kind of hoping they come to tabletop. There's somebody bringing it to tabletop soon. But until it happens, we have to be patient. I don't eat all the limbs, bro. I still don't understand how this auto sorting system works, but anyway. Yeah, I might start a campaign of a game called Unsettled. This is all just maybes, by the way. For the tabletop. I'm kind of feeling it. We'll see if I get around to it. But there's a cool co-op game called Unsettled. My friends and I did play the first round. We did succeed on our first attempt too. So I might play through that game. Uh, do all the missions and stuff in it. It's not really a campaign game, but it had my interest enough to experience the rest that it has to offer. Because if I don't do it solo, I know that we're not going to get to, or I won't get to experience all of it. And there's like five planets with three missions each, so a solid 15 or so things to do in that. Uh, Monster Hunter board game. I'd be interested in resuming. I'd have to watch where I left off. I still haven't. All right, I haven't finished uploading my Monster Hunter videos. There's like two more sitting on my hard drive. That's been waiting to get uploaded, and I just have been lazy about it. But <clears throat> I need to get to that. Getting distracted with the music. But yeah, I'd be interested in resuming the Monster Hunter board game. I'd like to complete a playthrough of it. Now, it's not like the most fantabulously executed, in my opinion. The, the way the campaign works. But I, I would like to do that. On that front, I'm still interested in doing a Gloomhaven as well. Digital and board game versions, and I'm still... If you guys remember from a really long time ago, and I've talked about this before, but there's a game called Madara that I was playing and I have lo lost my footage for this was back during uh, my old laptop and the shift to my new computer which is why Midora disappeared I've mentioned this before but this is a recent reminder for anyone who remembers that I was pretty far in it too so I was pretty annoyed I had fought like the giant summon fire lion guy I can't really remember how they work out but I had fought that killed it so succeeded down that path and was happy to continue going on that path but
Yeah, that, that, that game, I just I haven't gotten back around to playing it because I would need to start that over. I could watch through all of my hours of footage and try to piece together everything I was doing, but I would rather just start it over. And I'm not fully committed on the starting it over, so I haven't bothered, but uh, it's an option too. And then there's a bunch of other stuff I want to learn, although they're not on Tabletop Simulator yet. It's, uh, Earthsworn, Primal the Awakening, things of that nature. Why do I have Sofer on me? I don't know. Ah, oh, Scorpion, if you could just stop bopping me. Okay. So everything I just mentioned so far, it's all just tabletop things. Now I have a swath of games that I have slowly accrued via Steam sales like one dollar games and stuff when i had small bits of cash to spend i also have my friends library sharing there's a ton of rpgs and dungeon crawlers and shit that i have that i want to start so maybe we'll play some of those on the side i'll have to see what i'm in the mood for there's a lot of stuff that I want to get to. I just haven't gotten around to it yet. In that regard. And some of the other things I was working on. There are two things that I have footage recorded for, though I'm not finished. I wanted to experience all the Super Robot Wars games. I started on the second game. So I, I did begin that. And I need to finish it. So I might try to finish it a bit. Oh, Super Robot Wars 2. I was a handful of chapters in. Sorry, I got, got distracted in my head. I was a handful of chapters in. Oh, we can shortcut my food again. I'm not really using that other slot. Any more metal over here? There's like screws. I guess I should take some screws when I see them because they're kind of on a rare side. I might need some more. I'll just drop them off at the base. Uh, we got a swath of metal. I'm missing some some rows of metal. I'm pretty sure we had five full on a run. So I'm definitely missing some metal. Was this one obviously, but definitely missing some other metal spots. Now, a lot of these things were already dead, too. That's nice for me. Did an event start, by the way? I didn't know this. Was I wanted to keep working on events when I get the chance to. There is an event started, it's the roaches. Alright, let's head off 
I can't reset, so I have to manually go back. But we're going to tell my guy to wait. We're going to return to base. We'll do the event. I want to work on the events to unlock stuff and things. If possible. And we can pick up a damselfly and then go back to the base. Now, I do want to fix the ladybug cage. I decided at the beginning, or before I started streaming, I want to set up the cage so that the structure is completely connected. Instead of the weird setup I have currently. So we'll probably do some reconfiguring there. Where's my house? My house isn't... Oh, only one thing can be marked. All right. We might just go do this event and then go back to base. It's fine. And this way I can look around for some stuff of interest. See if there's any uh, hidden tunnels. There's lots of tunnels we haven't gone in yet. Need to get the albino gecko. Anyway, on my uh, random thought train for things I'd like to do, uh, Super Robot Wars, finishing that playthrough, I just need to find, like, when I started this, I went to make sure I get the zoo done, but it's at this period where I would work on something like that. Like the world event has begun. Ah, yeah, they are under us. <clears throat> it's that legendary cave back there. But, uh... Yeah, this is like the time period I would work on this stuff. It would be side things. Oh, I need this gecko too. We don't have this one. I guess I can tame him now. No. Let's not tame him now. I'm just gonna hope he doesn't die. Cause I have to wait for him to respawn, which isn't a big deal. Now, I have another game project that I was working on too. I haven't uploaded anything for it. I want to make sure I at least finish one run of it before I bother to upload things. And of course, I got distracted with other stuff, so it's been a while since I've worked on it. I won't. I think I talked about it before, but if I haven't, I won't spoil what it is. Oh, they killed the gecko. Those bastards. Where's this guy going? Six contribution points. Slowly and surely. <laughs> this game has not been updated in the couple weeks that I have been gone, so they haven't done any adjustments to that yet. Which I still think they should definitely work on improving that system. Now, there's going to be more updates. They had other things they want to add to the game, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure more updates are expected to be underway. Alright, I'm gonna head back to base. We'll drop off our stuff. 
And uh, most importantly, we'll drop off our scorpion and we'll go grab a damsel fly. And then we'll head to the zoo and look at it. And before I head to the zoo, I should make... I'm gonna... Hmm, maybe I'll just bring the metal... No, I can't bring the metal to the zoo. The zoo doesn't have the facilities required to craft... Uh, what I need. I'd have to build a windmill so I can turn clay into mortar and... I have to bring over bug lymphs and shit. So, we'll just not worry about that. Can I get a moment free here? I need to stand up for a second. Adjust my seat. I'm actually leaning too far forward at this time. I'm like hanging off of the couch or love seat here instead of sitting on it. Properly. I just don't want to be attacked by any bugs. And because I can't hear the combat music, I don't know if we're in combat or not. It should be safe up here, right? There's nothing over here. Right, give me a second to fix myself. Fix my seating. That's a little bit better. I don't know for how long though. <clears throat> I desperately want to save up the little bit that I do manage to pull together and get a proper chair again. I haven't had a proper chair in a while, and uh, I would like a proper chair. Let's get fiber while we're here. Always need more of this. Most important of ingredients. The damsel fly. I need to drop off the scorpion still. So I, like I said earlier, uh, we can't tame dragonflies. They're different. Earlier, this was like way back when we were playing. We can't tame dragonflies, and I don't know if there's a color variation of damsel fly. I'm only aware of the one, which is the blue one that we just passed. So. Yeah, it doesn't matter which one we get. We just need one of them. And I'll probably just get the one that's near the base by the... Secret door to crossing the river. Makes sense to me to pick that one up. <laughs> do I have regular grasshopper tamed? I think I do. This is why we're going back to the zoo. So I need to remember what do I have. Bug lymph and clay for clay mortar and then the structures of metal do you require just iron shards and pyrite right i have to do a pyrite run if i do a pirate run we're gonna go to the spider area in the desert and get that pyrite instead 
So I'm gonna drop this metal off at the uh, the base. The bug limps we want to leave here. Storm approaches. Uh, we'll take this metal with us. We'll just drop off all this metal for right now. And I picked up some extra of these in case we need it down the road. We're gonna get an extra slot. I need to summon my scorpion. party and we can't hear the music for it but I could river dance for you guys while we wait for the storm to pass <laughs> it's been a while since we river dance I have to put the sword away right yeah gotta wait till the storm starts <laughs> Oh, do we have in here? Oh, yeah, Tyrant's Crown I haven't made yet. To be fair, I think the Scorpion Armor is still the best defense and we're still in hard mode, so having aesthetically pleasing armor wouldn't really be... I be smart. Granted, yeah, that we can upgrade stuff. Uh, if I ever reach the point where I have a lot of point. Melisandre, which we're at. I have 42 to give. We're at 30. And we have eons to go. But we're not even going to think about that. Oh yeah, it's uh, raining now. This music's very peaceful for the rain. I lost my touch. <laughs> you, gotta, you gotta imagine the music. It'd be storming out there. <clears throat> I like my little boxy home here, so I don't know if I'm going to redux the home. We're definitely going to work hard on this zoo. The clouds disperse and all is right. Let's go smack a damsel fly in the face. There's a damsel fly, that's who we're looking for. Beautiful. Level one, all balanced. Because, you know, zero points. The only thing is I have to hit it and I can't use the gun. This weapon might be too strong. We should actually just hit it with an axe or something. Like the chopper. There you go. So I don't want to kill it by accident. Wow, it hurts. <laughs> it does damage. Okay, it might be okay to hit him once with the sword. Yeah, all right, we're not gonna nuke it. Oh, that crit almost nuked it. There we go. We have tamed a damselfly. 
I would like to beseech the name. Mm. Bestow the name. Bestow is the word we want. Listen to this thing. It's very chatty. Um. Hmm, I don't really have a name in mind. Let's call you Turquoise. Turquoise. Because of the turquoise colorations. Uh, the, the technical first flying mount. I'm gonna bring it to my base where I know it's gonna be safe. And then we'll teleport it over. This thing runs out of stamina so fast, it's such a sad flying mount. But it's still cool to fly on. It's got nothing on a hornet, though. So that gives me a inventory space. And we have our damselfly collection done. Since there's only one of these, unless I find another one, I'm gonna put it with one of the other... I don't know where I'm gonna put it. We got we gotta get back to uh I have to get back to my zoo and plan out what the fuck I wanna do with the zoo. I'd like to not aggro the ant. I don't have to worry about fixing my thing. And it's too bad I can't put this in a safer location, but that's all right. Where's the bird at? There's the bird. Uh, when I want to go thoroughly exploring around here again, we're going to have to kill that. I'm gonna need to make some more ammo for my gun. How much ammo do I have? <clears throat> Apparently I have none. I have 43. I don't want to shoot it. That ammo is preciously expensive to craft, so. I still have plenty more towers to disable. I do love the new OST for Sheeran 6. I still wish they included some past songs though. It's a lot of great music like this one. If, if they just... Like all the new dungeons have original music, so that's perfect. It's, uh, which most of them do have original new music in that play at points and it's great. And I love it. I just wish during... Uh, the like 99th floor, there's a ch odd chance for a classic song to run. I would be swell as well. Do, 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 do. do you have anything else to say since I've done all the stuff that I've done? 
No. And you don't have anything else in your house, right? Yeah, can I get this lighter thing constructed? Can I learn lighter tech? Can I find a lighter somewhere in the world? I still think this door is like oddly placed. having a back door to your house and it's oh I didn't even know he had a little side area here shranky fun to see nothing in it for us though hey where's that giant log there it is the start of my zoo I need to put some signs up around here or something. I want to build a cage in the front door. Oh yeah, Brent. What's up, Brent and Fabiano? My level 90 geckos. I only got the two so far, or we're missing three off the top of my head. The classic, the white, and the other one. And I think there's another in the world somewhere, but I don't know where. Alright, where's the ladybug pen? Where's my ladybug pen? Oh. This whole area is a zoo. <laughs> I'm gonna make a grand wall. Around the zoo. But yeah, this this part here, I was like, hmm, I might wanna restructure this. Here's our one dude and our two ladybugs. Maybe I'll fix this up later. We'll just use this as a storage cage for now. I might redo this whole thing. So. Damselfly. Turquoise. I forgot. What are my other bugs' names? Let's just leave Turquoise in the middle here. Chitan. The sky. Amber. This girl. <laughs> Darling. <laughs> you know, in this game, we never really solved the mystery of why the bugs have the glowing green eyes at night and why they're all so evil and stuff. That mystery was left unsolved. We, well, I mean, we know it wasn't entirely unsolved, actually. The guy went crazy from his, like, longevity or elixir, his super elixir. Made the guy go crazy and it was leaking. So that's probably why the bugs have gone crazy, I guess. Anyway, let's head back into the tree. We'll drop off the metal. We need to go get a ton more stuff. I need to go on a murder spree. Unfortunately. Wait, did I leave party with the thing? I forget. And then I told it to wait. Leave party. Hey, don't look at me like that, all of you. Stay put now. <laughs> the world event is about to begin. Guess I should head over to that. 
It's a shame no world events happen on this side of the map ever. Always over on the main. Ah, oh, this event. Yeah, I suppose we'll head over and do the event. Let me just drop off my metal. I do remember I don't have infinity fucking space here. We actually need a superior chest. What does this require? Garlic leaves and three iron ingots. Tell you what. Let me take these. An iron ingot costs some amount of shards. I'm gonna take a 50 stack because I know it's expensive. We'll make some iron ingots when I get back home. I'm gonna make a metal chest just for space. Hey, right, let us return. Post haste. Worry about salt farming later. I was wondering if that scorpion was chasing me, but I guess not. Okay. Just in case I want to build a chest set somewhere. If I build it anywhere, the chest pieces are invulnerable, right? So I would build it here. Just to have a collection of the things. Yeah, they can fit in the tree, so that's fine. What is this? Rook? Knight? Bishop? Yeah. And this doesn't need wind protection. So if I was to collect them, I may as well just make use of this chessboard here. Biggest cockroach, yes. I have two catapults to get out of here, and there's the bridge with the clay, which I probably should have went to, and then find some clay. And this way, by the bird on the tree branch. And I guess we're going this way. There it is. Look at all them fireflies. Is there fireflies or are they bees? I think they're fireflies. Not in the business of farming fireflies yet. Wahoo! Right, what is the event? It was over here, right? Should get my scorpion before we do the event.
It's uh, killing a bunch of lubers. Join me. Wait here. Oh, no. <clears throat> yeah, that's. Yeah, it is. Do, 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 do. I always wanted to play this game got an expansion. Blades of the Shogun? I really, really like Blades of the Shogun. I wanted to get a proper sequel. I know the last game they made was the Desperados 3. Not as in the Western themes as Japanese, but I would definitely give it a shot sometime. It's another game I'd like to play at some point. But there's um, Ico's Choice expansion, which I was curious about. I would be so rusty at playing that style of game, though. The world event has begun. I do hope they intend on adding more variety to the world events. I do hope. And I hope they fix some of these structures, like I remember this rock over here is fake. <laughs> There's no reason for this rock to not have collision, proper collision and stuff. They definitely need to fix some shit. Yeah, Vath has so much HP, Vath just doesn't care. I do think these events would be more fun with a group of people and you can work together and taking out the enemies. They're brutal in this difficulty. It's, I'm glad I have that. Uh, I'm glad I have that. Uh, 300% HP and 300% damage is no joke. Alright, I don't think I need an excess of this stuff, but pick it up because why not? It's kind of annoying that the bug lymph is edible and your pet rushes to eat them when it's a required material for mortar. Alright. I think the next thing I would like to do, I'll drop off my scorpion again. I want to pick up a jumping spider. I think you can get a jumping spider. And we want to pick up a wolf spider. This texture is looking weird over here. With the game devs thought of this area, they decided to add a resin spawn. Right here. Uh, 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 uh. Mm 
Is this the like queen zings thing? We already have her head. I do plan on hanging up the uh, heads. The two that you're able to get. In the zoo. And I guess it's a way of collecting. Collecting trophies is kind of like collecting uh, critters as well, right? Kinda. Kinda. Wait, you here? Leave party. This is a jumping spider test. I think jumping spider and wolf spider I want to pick up just to get the spider treats out of my inventory. Again, don't know if there's any variants on jumping spider and wolf spider. Now we've seen some high level jumping spiders. We, I know they've been around in different areas, but they're not of different colors. So I'm okay with just getting the ones that are over here. I forget where exactly they are. They're over here. There they are. It's about to go whale on it. Why is this thing in here? Okay, maybe jumping spider is not a tameable one. Maybe it's only wolf. <clears throat> okay, it's only wolf. Excuse you. You can't just claim this stuff as your own. <laughs> so I thought you could tame jumping spiders, but I guess it's just a wolf spider. This means I can look for a rare wolf spider variant, but I don't know of one that exists. I was hoping you could collect these guys. They're so cute. The I thought you could tame these guys, but I guess not. Or if I can, I have to unlock it as a separate treat. So, wolf spider then. And then I can deposit the other one until I know where a rare wolf spider is. We want to head out this way towards the tunnel. What's it? Yeah. Bum 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 bum. I guess we'll pit stop at base. Do a little inventory check. Maybe I'll roam around the spider area and see if I can't find a rare spider too. Do a little exploration. 
If there is a rare one, it's probably somewhere entirely different than uh, the main area they're, they're typically located at. Put one of these wolf spider treats away because I'm only aware of the one. And, um, what does this need? A sharkle. Oh, I have some iron ingots. Alright, let me save this here in case we need them. I think we only need three of these for one big chest. Mm-hmm. 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 Need some food stuffs and uh make sure we allocate stats and uh let's head to the speed. While I'm waiting for the hot air lift, I can do a little rolling action here. I see the lift has arrived. Just be a moment. It's still so chilly <clears throat> where I'm at. I cannot wait for warm spring weather to finally arrive, which it won't until like June. It's just gonna continue to be cold AF. Alright. Um, let's give it up. <laughs> Did you know I hold private dance parties in my house almost every night? It's not true. Maybe once in a while. Nobody ever comes, but I never invite anybody either. So it's just me and my groovy music. Damn, what a beautiful catapult. I don't even have to fly. What a beautiful shot that is. Holy. Okay, if we're gonna explore the area, we wanna start from I guess back here works and just have a nice look around. So there's this tree with a tire in it. And this is dragonfly territory. I guess I could use some more bark. While we're here. I 
you can see the uh, the boat. Wait, there's an upside down boat. Oh yeah, it's the rhino beetles. Do I mean? I don't think the devs would sneak any secret caves on the edge of this, but I don't know. I sure like to believe there's some hidden goodies in some strange places sometimes. This is the hunting grounds of a sky creature. Oh, there's a frog over here. This is the frog spawner. Regular froggy. If I'm not mistaken, I needed frog too. I'll wait till I have my scorpion just so he's easier. I could shoot him to death. So scorpion has a chance of eating the frog meat. Frog flesh times two. Nice. Very nice. Interesting, you can't go in further. You cannot acquire that bark that they decided to spawn. <clears throat> I wonder if the resource generation is actually... Like, I can understand if they have a parameter. So they say, alright, in this area spawn bark. And it just randomly spawns them in to the game world. Distributed in some fashion. That's probably how it works. But what, if you do that, I would go in and see anything that's out of the way or out of obtainable range and get rid of it personally. Because you can save a lot of resources by, you know, getting rid of stuff that nobody can ever use. That's not, that's probably not a big deal concern on their part. Uh, sky creature. This wolf spider is a little pale looking, isn't he? They don't always look like this, I'm pretty sure. So does that mean there are two unique wolf spiders? Or is it just the lighting? Hey, right, what do we name this guy? Ghost. So he's got a ghostly look, and he's apparently got three points to spend. We're going to want to up your uh, health, I guess. <laughs> and then they come with unspent points. I've not actually mounted the spider before. So they have the one attack. Wow, that might be the fastest ground creature, maybe. And can I climb vertically up a tree like I should be able to? Come on, game devs. If the spider had the ability to just climb on any surface, it would be a very worthwhile pet. <laughs> this is a fucking spider, you know? I mean, technically, the gecko should be able to do that, too. But yeah, this guy looks different from the other wolf spiders. I may have discovered a variant back here. And I'm glad I came back here. I actually had no idea this guy was back here. Let's leave him. And we'll uh, <clears throat> head back. I'll go up to the albino spider's entrance here, and um, I wanted to go inside of the tire just to see if anything was in the tire. 
I doubt it, but you never know. Yeah, there's nothing inside the tire. Black Widow. Alright, we'll head back. I'm gonna drop my spider off. I just started a new day, so he doesn't have to worry about another copy of himself spawning. I also want to look at a wolf spider and confirm. I think that was one over here. Yeah, nah, that's a widow. Scary widow. That's a wolf spider, though. Yeah, there's so much browner. Right? He's definitely browner with texture on. I think I got a variant. I don't have to get two spiders. I'm glad I made two spider treats. Then. I didn't even know there was a variant spider. See, this makes me think. Somewhere out there, there's a variant scorpion. And boy, I want it. Imagine if it's like a pretty blue or green or something. Oh yeah. This is what I look for in this game. It's variant color pets. Gotta catch them all. Let me get some basic supplies because we're gonna need charcoal and shit. Good opportunity. Well, I'm near all these saplings. This is definitely different. This is the generic spider. He's level 5, but when I got a 17, so he has the level difference. Variety 2. That it by and the fact that you can't get a jumping spider, I thought you could. But if you can't, that explains why the other ones we saw were all the same color. Because they're not tameable. And the not tameables never have color variants. At least as far as I'm aware of, they don't. Now I wonder if there's a third spider somewhere. I don't have to pay attention. now let's deposit some of this stuff in here because we got excess we have some toad meat toad meat no space for it in here, so I'm going to put it in the other thing. My odds and ends chest. Uh, 
I mean, I want my spider treat now. Let's go drop off our speed. I still think I should probably build a catapult over here too, just to launch me. Now I want to build a catapult from the zoo out of the zoo. That's what I want to do. Was that bird chasing me? Sure sounded close. I'm going to build a catapult on top of the gecko cage, because the gecko cage is kind of like the entry point I'm imagining. I'm imagining walking through the gecko cage into the park. <laughs> the zoo. metal chest already here <laughs> should I leave my hoots in here give me some more space I'm just gonna have to remember to pick them up at some point leave the bones now, I'll take the bones and put them back at home proper. I don't want to get too messy. I should have dropped off the herb tile stuff. Okay. There we go. We have storage space for the important ingredients of this area now where do we want spiders since i know there's two of them and not just one of them could put them on top not the geckos they could climb the top of this i don't want any of them to walk off towards the scorp though right I'm still always a little concerned that the scorp is um, possibly going to aggro. He shouldn't, but that's as long as we stay inside of the thing. I'm going to make my launcher pad here. That's what we're going to do. Yeah, if only I could just put it on the ground, but it requires full-on support. Full-on foundational support. I guess I can do wood foundation. Why not? I got some bark on us. 
do a one, a two, a three, and then this has to just be wood floor. Boom. And then we need to uh, do some walls. Why not do wood? I never do a wood structure. Yeah. And then wood roof. Or. Yeah. Roof. Bum bum. Napida, as Mogwai would say. Oh, bit of a steep fall there. Yeah, the wood roof's actually kind of nice looking. It's got moss on it and stuff, so there's a little green texturing. I'm gonna need to make some more string and refined wood. I'm gonna need to make some more refined wood. Ah, uh, this is aimed in the wrong direction. This is the go home catapult. Okay, so we finally have a bit of a fast travel back. Spider cage. Hmm, this little area could be a nice pen. Use the rocks as a wall and we can just build out around here. A little curvy pen. This could be the grasshoppers area. This is nice for the grasshoppers. I like that. Yeah, I like that a lot. I make this the grasshopper cage. And then the damsel fly can be, uh, I can rest it on a tree. Maybe build like a little structure on a tree for the damsel fly to sit on. So we have lizards in the tree, grasshoppers here, the bird, the bird I might literally rest because I need it to not aggro on anything. I might just build a giant platform in the back of the beach where he's far away from any enemies at all. <laughs> I still haven't bothered to farm for the bird yet. We need, what, 500 hoots? It's a lot of hoots. But we'll get to the farming. Get to it eventually. Uh, spiders. Where do I want the spiders? Do I want him on the rock here? Let's call forth ghost. Come here, ghost. Look how pale you are. I'm sure ghost doesn't want to be in the sunlight. <laughs> hmm. This thing over here, what what spawns out of this spawner? It's starting to rain. Is this a scorpion? Or is this the ladybug spawner?
Or does nothing spawn out of here? Maybe it's leftover? And something's got to spawn out of it. Oh, there's a scorpion. There's a scorpion spawner. So there's an enemy scorpion too far out this way. Which I'd like to avoid too. I could share the log of the lizards with the spoods. Could do that. I could make a custom spider den. It would be a lot of uh, construction effort, but we could do a custom spider den. Cause I'm gonna have to come up with something for the hornets too. Hornet ranch. Look at all these awesome pets. There's gonna be so many more. You guys just stay put for now. Hmm. <clears throat> yeah, I can do a spider box. But I'm gonna need to get construction materials. So for right now, you're gonna have to uh, chill in the cage with everybody else and play nice. Don't eat anybody. All right. Don't eat anyone. I'm gonna separate all the all eaters. Oh shit, I forgot to tell her not to follow me. <laughs> I was like, I hear a spider sound and I never hear a spider sound here. This cannon that's up here, I want to kill this cannon while I'm at it. I know I don't have scorp Scorpizoid with me, but... I can do some classic combats. I don't even know if my scorpion would spawn up here. On this one. I would. <clears throat> I have to be careful. Now, there's like nowhere to fight these guys up here. Down we go. Oh, there's another one too. <laughs> oh, hey, you're solo. I was just thinking I should probably, uh... <clears throat> Can I shoot you guys? After I reload, <laughs> slowly in front of your faces. I'm 
I'll need to restock on my elixir and whatnot. Okay. Give me your hoots. I don't know where his hoots went. There they are. Yeah, the fact that you can walk on the wall like that is badass. But cheating. Okay, let's go kill the big bad boss. Have to be really careful with the boss man there. Where did I like perch? There's a spot I was perched on and I didn't fall from it. It's like up here, yeah. Okay, that's enough. Now, yeah, he's resistant to everything. I think the sword does more. It's faster. Holy! Gotta remember how deadly these guys are. In this difficulty, they are the deadliest for sure. Well, second to the archers. Uh, Fly's got nothing on on Aetherian elites and the archer sharpshooters. Okay. So that's another tower down. I'll take care of the other ones when I have my scorpion with me. It's just so much easier. But I want to get rid of this one. For sure, I want to get rid of this one. I disabled. Yeah, that, those are both done. I did those two. That's funny. You can see the catapult. Chill. Alright, let's go tame another wolf spider. This time a generic one. And then I can look around the spider area some more and just see what else is there. Damn, that's a nice catapult swing. This is a lot safer of a way to get back. So I can run on a tree. I could build another catapult up here too. To launch me. Oh, they need to fix this. Yeah, they don't expect you to climb up here, clearly. Game da. <laughs> people are gonna come up on the tree. I think we gotta clean this up a bit. I'm gonna definitely climb up on the tree. This is, this is a real attractive centerpiece, right? Of course we want to climb on the tree. I think we gotta clean up some of that. Even if there's nothing special here, there, maybe you guys could hide a little something. It would be cool to stumble upon some more face mask 
decorations. Yeah, I, I could build that too. We can actually edit my character to be something I like now that we're done with the hardcore part of the challenge run. And while I'm here, we're going to, of course, farm the Maclise. The ever important Clise. I've been tempted to play some Dark Souls again, too. I was watching Caleb Hart go through the Convergence mod demo, or not Convergence, there's some big new mod demo that adds like a whole bunch of original content. A lot of new spells and stuff. It seemed really cool. I'll be back for this grasshopper friend later. I'm in the mood to play too many games, honestly. If only I could gaze upon a ho-oh like Ash Ketchum and then live eternally gaming. That would be something. Then I may as well do it every game ever made challenge. That would be hard as fuck. <laughs> That'd be a lot to go through. I don't know if I would do that. If I had infinite time, I probably wouldn't play every game ever made. There's a lot of stuff I don't care for. I have to play horror games which I don't want to play. So I mostly don't want to play horror games, not for the fear factor, but for the sanity of my ears, or the safety of my ears. So I watch Elias play those, especially the janky indie ones. And indie game devs, I gotta tell you, Especially you horror game devs. They call it daily quest. <laughs> as soon as they get a loud sound, the chat spams loud equals scary, which is funny. And they spam daily quest. I don't know how the daily quest thing started entirely, but seriously, to, to the horror game devs, you've got to fucking volume control your games. You've got to turn that shit down. Nobody needs their ears destroyed playing your video game just for a jump scare. You don't have to play a loud sound effect to create a really good horror atmosphere. And even if you want to resort to a cheap jump scare, it doesn't have to be ear destructively loud. You can turn down the audio and the jump scare will be just as effective. <laughs> I really wish this is the year of our lord 2024 and horror game devs are still making games with the most terrible of audio balancing so that is one of the main reasons why I don't want to play horror games myself you know, I can have Ella on half volume and not wearing headphones, enjoy watching him on the side, and he can endure the suffering of the daily quest. <laughs> and I can not have to deal with that. Hell Silk Song coming out, yeah. 
That was another thing I thought about doing, and I did start it, and I never finished it. Because I got stuck on a hard boss, but I was doing a... a... Nail only. Unupgraded. Nail only. No damage. Hollow Knight run. But because I was I was just tackling bosses, so I would start recordings at the front of a boss and end it if I got hit. I, I wasn't doing like a full game playthrough of no hit. That would be fucking mind-bogglingly hard. I made it pretty far. I had some impressive boss fights down pat. I got up to the stupid uh, Luke Marm, though, and Luke Marm poses a huge technical problem for nail only. I'm not sure I'm skilled enough to do that fight without getting hit. So I never finished the challenge. Because of Luke Marm, of all things, the, the amount of uh, little flying worm shitters it spews at you is just way too hard to deal with when they take, I think they take like 3-4 hits to kill with a nail, and they don't really deflect. I also don't know how I wanted to tackle uh, going to that game, because I was doing no magic. I was considering getting Shadow Dash and allowing Shadow Dash to be a thing, because that would help make that fight doable. But, uh, I'll have to think about that later and make it that far. That's a challenge I may return to down the road. But it'll be very, very much down the road. Uh, this should be in the metal chest. This should be in the metal chest. And these should should put away the herptile bones and leather. And I need to refine some wood, so I need some seed oil, which I know I have. Oh, I need some seeds, not seed oil. No, 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 I was on the wrong thing. Yeah. Let's get a 20 stacker. Gonna need to get some food again soon. I'm running low on my uh, basic necessities, so let's do a food run. Then I'll go grab the other spider. But yeah, for this Hollow Knight challenge I was doing, I... I don't know if I still have the footage. I don't think I have my footage still. I'd have to start over. I might have the footage? Curious. I'm curious. Did I preserve that? Or did I abandon it outright? I think I abandoned it outright. Which is fine. I would need to figure out how exactly I'd want to go about doing something of that nature for Hollow Knight. Cut these poppies while I'm at it. We were a little low on seed oil. <clears throat> Hello? Oh. Trying to cut down the uh, non-cuttable giant plant. I 
I still want to do the uh, Mega Man Perfect Runs too. Although I want to step it up a notch and do full game instead of individual level. Based on what I've seen, I've only ever seen people do Mega Man 1. Buster only damageless. There's a single playthrough. I haven't seen people pull off 2 yet. Or any of the others. But then I think, oh, it's gonna be. That would be obnoxiously hard. And I wouldn't do it until after my side quest is done. So this is all like. 40 plus year old Harpoo. Decades away planning. Hopefully, I can still play games decades from now. I'd be quite content if I could. Alright, I think we got enough strawberries and some honey crumplies. Strawberry jam. Okay, I'll just make 12 more. Save the rest. Uh, seed oil. Just deposit this stuff. <clears throat> Just to make space, I'm gonna kill a stack of petals because petals are such an excess thing. I know other recipes use them, but. We don't really need other recipes. If there was an easy-ish to craft high-tier food. Because everything in here blocks loss for 720 seconds. But I have to make flour for cake. This one's not too bad considering how many eggs we get when we go silk farming and insect fat. I, I don't usually pick it up, but I could. Where do you make flour? It's in the windmill, right? I feel like it's not worth the uh, effort to build these when I can just do a strawberry jam. Every once in a while. And then nectar is way too precious for me to... This nectar makes the, uh... Health elixirs... Which I should restock up on my health elixirs. Do I have some nectar? Do you have some? Is it a nectar pebble? Seed oil. I was interested in playing this game. It's got some fun music. But I never got around to, uh, I probably won't play it. Honestly. Oh, that was the wrong thing I just constructed. Well, I'll keep them in case, but whatever. I don't even know what resource to use. Let's go spend this wolf treat. Get the regular wolf spider. And I haven't seen an event pop. I have not been noticing an event is about to begin. I don't see any, but I've not been noticing it either. Maybe there's just not an event going on at the moment. So I know the time is flying. The time do be flying. Why 
I don't have the bug lymphs on me. Oh. Now, why do I have a 50 stack of bug lymphs on me? Hold up. Damn it. I can't walk off the thing. I think I took it out because I was making uh, mortar stuff. <clears throat> Next time I head over to the thing, I should take that black bishop with me. So we have one black horse and one black bishop for the chess set. I'd like to go up this great tree, please. Saw the name for the spider. So I'm just gonna get the one that's at the entrance of the area. Because he's pretty safe to uh, farm. Is this hold up? <clears throat> I guess it's like a top half a flash thing for a camera. Yeah, I saw it in the black mask. There. I was just like, What is this? Spider is the one I was gonna get. Whoa! The hell? Did you see that? There was a black spider and it just disappeared. Now, this is a nighttime one, isn't it? No, this is just wolf spider. What was the black spider that we saw? Is there another spider nearby? To name him Chitters the Spider. Chitters the Wolf Spood. So, yeah, what was that black spider that we saw and it just disappeared? It wasn't that, was it? Hold up. You wait here. And hopefully you'll be safe. Is this a widow? This is a nocturnal. I guess it was just a nocturnal spider. And this guy's not tameable. I'm gonna confirm, but. Yeah, he's not tameable. Okay, so this is what the black spider was. Or your beetle. I'm not gonna die. There's no way. <clears throat> Maybe I should start collecting this crap.
Uh, it's just another normal wolf spider, so let's head back. Uh, my wolf spider kill an ant. I'm glad he's healthy enough to kill an ant. You gonna eat that? No? He should be fine over there. Till I can call in the base. Okay, so I want some blackberries later. I'll get you soon, Hornet. I'll get you soon. Starting to become quite speedy with their level ups. Now. <laughs> Remember when the red ants used to deal like half our life and damage? Oh yeah, I still I'm gonna take a moment since we're right here. I've been wanting to explore the mine shaft. I forget if I did this yet or not. I'm pretty sure there's nothing in here of note. I should do it with my scorpion because it would be easier, but we're just gonna run through and ignore the ants. So I think this is just a dead end, right? It's just an elaborate dead end with a lot of stone. Some screws. Yeah, it's just an elaborate dead end. So I can roll off the uh, ant mine. There's nothing of interest in here as far as I'm aware. Can think of it like a mini dungeon for newer players that really want to get a bunch of stone going. Because you're, I'd say, directed to come this way early. For sure. What's up, chitters? This is Vap. Play nice. <laughs> He'd probably be quaking and be like, oh dear god. Alright, spider head. Her poison you look is in here. Spider eye. Chitin beetle thing fat. I've got a 50 stacker of fat, so I gotta just keep it in here, I guess. With the rest of my random shit, let's take the chest piece. So that'll make a little bit of space. Make sure we build the chest piece on my way over. Let's eat some fud. Drop off my spood. Oh, well, I'll get it later. I was gonna bring the mortar to this fine. I'm gonna be making numerous trips here. As usual. Okay, if I'm stopping by the chess area. We'll do it now on the way over rather than on the way back.
I don't think I'm going to complete a full chess set. I'd have to be pretty bored to want to do that. My desire is definitely geared towards the zoo. But for the time being, I will make a small effort. Black Bishop. This bishop doesn't actually have a face. So I guess this way is fine. It's got like a little dot, I suppose. It doesn't have like that mouth or carved in section. Dun 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 Oh wait, there's two tables, hold up. I didn't realize there are two tables. Imagine being so anal you want to complete both tables, but this one is open, so it makes more sense to build it here. There's no tree in the way. Looking good, looking good. Alright, now I am going to ignore the fact that there is, I believe, a bird around this area. And we're just gonna go. It's that army guy. Still feel like there should be a fifth one. There's, there's the guy with the radio. I swear I remember a guy with a radio. Now, I don't know if he's in the game somewhere. But when I. When we go out exploring for random shit maybe we'll get lucky and find it maybe we won't i'm gonna try to be thorough in my exploration but i have no idea how well i will do can't be that many things we haven't seen in the game by this point right Surely not. Too many secrets remain. I need to cage these in so that they can't get to where they want to go. I, I know it'll work. It should work. So once they're caged in, and I need to cage in the other group because I think it's like two groups. And then I can claim the uh, area for myself. Why do I feel like I'm missing a lizard? Did I really only tame the two? <laughs> I like my geckos. World event. Alright, we'll do the world event too. I was gonna park it soon. Keep this on the shorter side. The zoo construction project. This is gonna take quite a while. So, small land content, I will trickle it forth as I put more time into the uh, idea here. Where the fuck are my... <laughs> as long as these two haven't gotten out. Come on, darling, don't you want to say hello to me? That's better. I have a new friend, everybody. Meet Chitters. Yeah, he is different. Right? It's, it's easier to tell when they're next to each other. So two spiders. Two spiders in the game. Alright. I did leave party, right? My fucking damselfly just ditched. As long as it stays in the general vicinity. <laughs> hmm. I 
I'm really curious if there's a third spider somewhere. Where would a third wolf spider be? And it'd have to be a higher level than 17, considering color variations are based on the level ratings. Where did these guys spawn from? Or are they the three that spawned from the other spot? And they just come all the way out here. <clears throat> no, those are the three that came from the other spot. There's a different spawner. There's whatever the spawner is for those three on the beach is the one I want to block. This one is whatever. Uh, let's like get around the building here. Uh, what event is happening? If it's the rhino beetles, that event's never worth. It's not. Uh, it's the loopers again. Alright, I just have to get my scorpion. Let's go get my scorpion. It would get me around faster if I launch from right here. And it seems like a pretty good spot to launch from. I have enough to make one more catapult, right? And then I need to make fiber string. Oh, uh, building is not allowed here though. All right. I'm not allowed to build here. One's a tree. Maybe I should grind for the bird. And I can fly back much faster. Oh yeah, I had this argument before. I forgot. The reason why I haven't done it is because I need to not have the bird in my party in order to take an animal to the zoo. And then it doesn't save me any time. Anyway. Now that's nice river flow right there. Hmm, this is a pretty high point in the game world. I hope the devs keep adding to this game more new stuff, more tables. When I get on the other side of the bridge, that would be the like this whole area here would be the the most obvious new inclusion because it's already kind of on the map. There's space here for it. If they want to add content up to the corners, that would be rad. And then there's space paths here. They, they could fill this in with like an entire cave system or something. And you could just add whatever back here. <laughs> now, I'm sure the devs will want to be finished with the game at some point, but... It's always some nice feeling about being up really high. That watchtower looks so small. Considering how tiny we're supposed to be from this distance, I feel like it should look bigger than that, right? Just climbing up the thing definitely feels like an ordeal. 
I wonder if it's just not scaled well from a distance. Because looking at it from here, it looks like I could go from the bottom to the top. There's only four of those cross sections to climb up. One, two, there's only three <laughs> of those cross sections. But when you're actually doing it, there's like six plus or something. So this is a little bizarre. Anyway. Catapult ourselves, maybe get some more uh, clay. Cause it's a new day. Cause it's a new day. We're gonna farm clay. And we'll finish our lizard collection next. I said I'd take a break, but I think I want to go get that lizard that's near the cockroaches. Once I'm done with the event. Getting my six measly points for the event. Speaking of which, I shouldn't farm this for that long so I can actually get the event before it's gone. The event lasts for quite a few minutes, so... It's not like it's gonna immediately disappear. And Kirby music goes hard sometimes. Am I kidding? Kirby music goes hard all the time. Even the happy tunes, they're hard happy tunes, let's be real. Some of, some of these clays are really obtuse to acquire. <laughs> Fine, we'll leave that one. Let's uh, get Scorpy, bro. Kill a bunch of lubers. I forgot to leave my hoots at the hoots treasure chest. I should probably um, build another catapult in this area. Aimed off in this direction. Ha! Huh. 
The world event has begun. Come to me, King. They do add more content and assuming it gets harder and harder. I wonder how much HP they're gonna fucking have. Like if the scorpion is 15,000. I should have glided down here first. He, he doesn't take fall damage really. Swarm of giant Luber monsters, man. Hey, you want to fight these for me while I'm uh, harvesting their shit? Block one, you can't block the other though. Pincy, 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 pincy. Give him the pincy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I love you, Scorpion. You, you make it so easy, it's so mindless. Okay, you wait here. I'm going back home. I don't want to like fall in the water, that would be bad. How do I usually get back home from this area? Hard to sing along with the uh, original parts, but I love the I love when a remixer adds in their own little section of originality. <laughs> Nothing gets me going like a solid Mega Man remix. <laughs> Alright, I made up my mind. I want to get the lizard too. That'll be the last thing I do. And then once we deliver it, I can save and quit and we can save and quit warp. You know, we'll be back at home next time we start. So, 
We're gonna get a uh, the one with the cockroaches because that one always dies to the roaches. So I want to make sure I pick it up. All right, we're headed south towards the Rhino Beetle. I think I can launch southward with this thing. Oh yeah, and drop off my stuff too. <laughs> oh, I did not want to eat that. Since we're making use of the bug limbs, I'm going to take them out of this box and then we can get a second pile of fat going. And I know this is pile of fat, but whatever. <laughs> Three, two, one, fire. gauge where I am on the map. I don't know where we're going. I keep forgetting what is the uh what is the shortcut? No, 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 no. Down. I'm going the right way. Now the real tricky one is going to be finding that albino again because I only vaguely recall where it is and I didn't map it. I can always check through my video footage. But we'll, we'll find it. We'll find it. Alright, let's tame ourselves this gecko in here. About to say, there's no way that's chasing me. Theme. Okay. This one's got the teal underbelly. I don't know if it's just the area. I need to pull them out. What do I name you? We have what, Brent and I forget the other one, Fabiano? The geckos have weird, like, human names <laughs> next to chat, but I'm not streaming now. Oh, I'm gonna name this one. It's gonna be Sally. Sally. Alright, Sally. Now, it's scary in here, but they won't spawn in and kill you. Right. It's safe as long as the event doesn't happen. And we'll be too far away for the event to happen. Did I build a catapult down here that shoots you up by the beetle? I think I did. Did I not do that? I think I did do that. Where's my catapult at? And we need to get a regular gecko still. I will get later, so I can only do one in the party at a time. Bum 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 bum. 
I swear I made a catapult down here somewhere. I swear I did. It was to gather flint and to get out quickly, but I don't remember where I put it. So that's a problem. I mean, it doesn't matter. I just wanted to shortcut back, but I guess we'll take the long walk back. Yeah, Hornet versus Cockroach, aka Waterbug. Go away, bees. I heard you buzzing. I know you wanted me. Bum, 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 I'm gonna act like you didn't just do that and let you live. <laughs> okay, we are back uh, home and um, let's do some of the uh, where's my thing at? Oh, this. I want to make some fiber string and then I will work on getting some extra fiber on my way. <clears throat> okay. Let's go drop off our new gecko friend to the zoo. And then this will be the last thing I do for this session, just so you all know. And like I said, I'll continue working on this slowly but surely. There's a few hours at a time as I have time. It's gonna take a while with the crew all the animals. And I have to farm a ton of resources. I may do some off-screen farming. So non-stream farming. I'm sure you guys won't mind. 
if I just want to zoom out to a stream or something and then get a bunch of metal get a bunch of clay and get a bunch of bug limbs for clay and mortar so that we can make a ton of metal structures Catch me, nerd. So, as usual, uh, if you know of any variant pets in Small Land, feel free to let me know. So, today we discovered a new spider that I had no idea was even a thing, and now I'm wondering if there are more wolf spiders at least. Surely there's a high level version somewhere out there. Surely. <laughs> All these dangerous beasties that live here. Oh, he's got a little campfire out here. It's turned off. It's kind of nice. Soon. I thought that scorpion was going on the offensive there. We have made it home. Come here, Sally. Let's introduce you to the gang. Please don't come from that side, though. Oh yeah, I love the blue on Sally. Oh, she's looking so good. I'm gonna move them around later, but for the time being, because they don't come to you when you, uh... What do you mean, Gecko? It's Sally games. So she has to be in my party, I think. Now, there you go, Sally. <clears throat> Just gonna line them up so they're all facing each other. They're having a combo for right now. So we got two black ones. One with the blue, one with the orange. In my opinion, this one should be the level 99. I like it more than the yellow bottom, but it's all good, it's all good. Do they all have that opening slit? Yeah, they do. So it's a gecko thing. <clears throat> I hope I can find more with like this sort of unique pattern because I don't think any of the other ones have this pattern. I forget what the albino one looks like. Maybe the albino one's got this sort of thing going. <clears throat> This is looking good. The dream. One step at a time, we shall complete the dream. Let me, uh, while I'm thinking about it. So we have over 100 hoots. We need 500, I think, for a bird egg. So only 400 more. I will go around clearing out the towers so we'll get some hoots from that and then I'll have to farm hoots from I don't even know what by killing the guys with the scorpion would be the most efficient means rather than farming pyrite to then sell so that's the scam way <laughs> safe but inefficient I just want to look at my pets here again before I de depart for the evening. 
in the afternoon. Oh uh, yeah. They're crammed in here now, but we'll give them all their space. We will give them all their space. We're gonna have, have grand plans. I hope there's another spider. It's cool that there's two. I'd like another damselfly, too. I really don't know where another damselfly would be, though. But I will look around for it. And then we need to get the pink and the green and the other grasshopper. Just can't remember now. Is there another grasshopper besides the pink and the green? I think there's a fourth grasshopper. Oh yeah, look at these amazing bugs. Including you, yellow, yellow bastard. I wonder if there's another ladybug somewhere out there. Oh, this is gonna be great. <clears throat> I haven't even started the hornets yet. I don't know where I want to put the hornets. I was thinking I would build like a tree. Like structure. This depends on if the hornets chase you or not. Like the... When I get close to these guys, they come towards me. Yeah. See, they try to get to me. So I honestly wish they didn't do that. Or if they do it, I wish it was a smaller range of them doing it. I was gonna build like a tower and have some side platforms to uh, do the tree. I'm not gonna worry about this world event. Anyway, thanks for watching as always. Hope you enjoyed. If you guys tune in for the zoo, we're gonna continue collecting stuff next time. And slowly but surely get this thing built. Take care, though. Hope you all have a good one.